inside the Sheffield Arena, Neil and Glenis Kinnock. I remember it vividly. Uh, I was watching it on television and suddenly Neil Kinnock burst onto the stage like a vaudeville comic shouting, well, all right, uh, well, all right. Well, all right. Well, all right. Well, all right. Are they going to have expenditure on a system of weapons in whose purchase we actually reduce our effective uh, defenses by the Army, the Navy and the Air Force, and with whose use uh, we would have our country obliterated. Does the right honourable gentleman believe that Britain will gain advantage from a single country? Yeah, yeah. Mr Speaker, they first of all are going to have to define the possibility of getting a single currency. Assuming Point. that there is a single euro. Yes or no? As the right honourable gentleman, as the right honourable gentleman will know, as the right honourable gentleman will know, there is no yes and no answer. No. To that question. No, there isn't. And on the central issues of Europe's future, they will not tell us where they stand. Do they want a single currency? The right honourable gentleman doesn't even know what it means or its consequences. <laughs>